Have you ever wondered how Google Earth gets those images from those areas where there's hardly any access? Well, I'm Michael Boucher, and today on Tech Talk, we're gonna show you how. I've got Matt Brown here from Google's Digital Aerial and Mobile Image Technologies, and he's gonna show us how it's done. How's it going, Matt? Great, it's my pleasure. All right. So how do you get these images when there's no roads, there's really no access? Well, you're looking it. at it. Uh, we use a modified remote control unit, okay. uh, and that gives us that bird's eye view. Nice, so this is the prototype we were talking yes. about. Yes, this is actually the beta version of the helicopter. Okay. It's outfitted with a new 3D camera, and we're gonna unveil the footage later this year with Google Earth 3D. Okay, and that's the new platform. Yes. Okay, all right. Okay, great. And you're gonna show us how this is done? I sure am. All right, let's go. Okay, so the camera's ready to go. Yep. So all you gotta do is just fly it over to whatever you, whatever you need. Yeah, exactly. Okay, whatever, all right. Whatever part we wanna capture. Okay. Let me just get this off the ground first. Okay. Wow. Yeah, it actually moves pretty easy. Oh, it's awesome. Yeah. I'd like to let you have a try. See how you do at it. Okay. 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 And the camera focuses all. It gets all the three yeah. D. Camera does the work on its own. You just control the angles. Okay. Here. All right. Okay. So leave it. Yeah. Just hover, right just hover right there, okay. Yeah, you just want to go ahead and take it along the coast. Just keep it nice and slow so you can capture all the detail. Okay. Yeah. Like that? Uh-huh. And then we'll take... Oh, 